Now, your weather forecast with meteorologist Jasmine Lomax. Welcome back. Well, it was another warm day outside and still very nice. We're currently sitting at 91. Feels a little bit warmer. Feels like 93. Winds out of the south southwest at around nine miles and across the rest of the southern portion of the state. Heat indices mainly in the 90s. Feels like 92 in Gonzales, 90 in Hammond. New Orleans slightly warmer at 94, but these values could be a lot higher. Fortunately, they're not. That's because our dew points right now are mainly in the 60s. So we're currently at 65, but tomorrow our dew points are going to jump into the 70s. So you notice that it feels a lot more steamy outside, but the good news is tonight at least we stay nice and dry. Notice there's not much going on on the satellite and radar. We're staying dry overnight with partly cloudy skies. We're going to fall into the 70s to about 72. So that's actually where we should be this time of year, but tomorrow it is going to feel a little bit steamy. So for Father's Day around 7 a.m. We're at 76 throughout the day. Expect a mix of sun and clouds around 12 p.m. You'll notice that it does start to feel hot and steamy with those higher dew points. Then as we continue through the day around 5 p.m., there is that chance that we could see a few spotty showers in the area, but overall a warm day and we're expecting lots of sunshine. So our UV index is actually in that extreme range with a burn time of about 10 minutes. So if you do have any outdoor plans, make sure to grab the hat, sunglasses and of course the sunscreen. If you're outside during the middle of the day, especially make sure to find shade and limit your time outdoors. Now, despite all of the sunshine that we are expecting tomorrow, there is that slight chance for a few showers. So take a look at the future cast. This is the H triple R model. We're nice and dry as we wake up in the morning, but as we head into the afternoon, we start to see those isolated showers in the area. Now it doesn't look like it will be a washout, but you may want to grab the umbrella or a rain jacket just to be on the safe side. By about 8 p.m. We are nice and dry and that's how we stay as we head into Monday. However, we are expecting some more showers, so about a 30% chance for a few showers tomorrow. That's going to jump to 60 on Monday and on Tuesday. On Wednesday, we're at 70%. Then Thursday, uh, some more scattered showers in the picture, but after that, our chances do start to diminish. Overall, though, you do want to make sure that you grab the rain jacket and the umbrella. So keep those handy for this upcoming week. Now, we're mainly quiet in the tropics. There is one system that we're looking at. Uh, notice, though, the chance of formation over the next two and five days is very low, and it's going to continue to move away from land and stay away from the Gulf. So that's something that we really don't need to worry about. But again, tonight we're dropping to about 72, partly cloudy outside with a light breeze and nice and seasonable. Then tomorrow for Father's Day, a hot and steamy day. Expect a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day. And of course, in the afternoon, that slight chance for a few isolated showers. Now we've partnered with iHeartRadio Baton Rouge to give your weather on the go. And this is what we're looking at over the next few days. It's going to be hot tomorrow and it's actually going to be one of the hottest days of the week. Notice it starts to get a little bit cooler on Monday and Tuesday. However, with the humidity, it's going to feel a lot warmer. Again, we're expecting those showers on Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. Even on Thursday, a few showers are possible. On Friday, we're at 90, so we do start to gradually get a little bit warmer. But notice partly cloudy skies. Same thing on Saturday with a slight chance for precipitation. Now, due to the warm temperatures and the humidity, our skeeter meter is in that high range. So make sure that you grab the bug spray and just remember to check your blood pressure. We'll be right back.